sorry, that Sue quote just made me like laugh out loud. That was that's a good one. All right, uh, unmuting myself and mumble here. Hey everyone. Yeah, I got it open on my phone off to the side there. <laughs> Double stream. All right. Oh, Moxley's doing good. I'm really glad to hear that. I really liked him in, uh, you know, when he was getting to do his own thing a couple years ago. Uh, Moxley is the wrestler who was known in WWE as Dean Ambrose, and he's very, very good. <laughs> Yes, not terribly audible, but pleasant. That's fine. Mm hmm. All right, let's see what we got here. We are starting today with, uh, well, let's set the scene first of all. Uh, Xenon, did you get my message in mm, the thing? And. <laughs> All right, if that's fine, then we can set the scene. Uh, they, can't. they can't hear you. Did it fuck up again? That's incredible. Is it just because you're on the... Oh, that's very possible. Just a second, though. Let me fix it here as well. All right, try talking. I'm doing a talking. All right, now... Now y'all can now y'all can hear the rest of y'all. Uh, is tabletop sim a good get for a laptop that isn't necessarily all that amaze balls? It doesn't have super high things. Requirements, that's the word. I'm not entirely here, as one might expect when we're getting bad weather in Oklahoma, but I'm gonna do my best. Oh, all right. So thank you for pointing that out, Bad Road. It's this this it doesn't it doesn't like picking up mumble all the time and then I have to fix it. All right, let's make sure that they can still hear you guys. Hello. Excellent. Perfect. Hello. So according to Steam, the minimum requirements for a tabletop sim is like 4 gigs of RAM and 3 gigs of space, which is not awful. Mm -hmm. I don't know what most of the rest of these words mean. Uh, you, you can just link that in the chat. That'd probably be the best way. Um. <laughs> I just realized I never plugged in my, my UPS. So that's, that's probably not going to be a problem, but... Yeah, if your power goes out, though, you know, your computer will, fine. too. All I mean, right. technically, it's not my dog, it's Lucas's dog, and also technically Zoo's dog, I guess. <laughs> Everyone's dog but yours. Yeah, I'm my own dog, so it's fine. I'm puppy, and also kitty. Mm. Ah, thank you, Alma. That's very helpful to get some uh, experience there. And thank you, Christy, for the link, which should show Riz exactly what he needs. Also, hi, Alma. That's, That's just the, the link to... to tabletop simulator in steam yeah um, but that'll have the system requirements right near the bottom yes okay so let's set the scene uh rye is just approaching the station and jasmine is driving up to the station around the same time with lonnie and maribel in a truck it's a different a, truck a different truck. Crash the other one yeah charlie's gone out to retrieve the uh the truck and the salvage uh, and Pam is presumably inside the station with Alan. So here is where we begin. <clears throat> Ryan Jasmine's company companies pull up to the station at the same time. Once again, it's eerily silent. The doors are closed and the lights are off. Pam's supposed to be here with Alan. Something isn't right. And that's y'all's cue. 
Oh boy. I know, that was a very short intro, because we had to quit in the middle, and I totally just fucked up the size of the window, but it doesn't look too bad on stream, it's fine. Oh, we're gonna solve this mystery. (laughs) (laughs) I just got that reference, oh god, um, well... uh, Just up and search for clues. I, uh, no, hey, I don't know that yet. We haven't watched the tapes. Uh, That's well, true. I, I guess the first thing that you do is is uh, look for clues. <laughs> All right, well, I mean, go ahead. I mean, yeah, we can do that. I don't know how. What I do. Chesman, you say these things, but then you don't, like, explain them? What clues? I... I, I, don't know, just... I don't know clues. You find shit on the ground and you say jinkies, and then all of a sudden you know where the people went. <laughs> I don't. No, I it's don't fine. Think it's that's fine. Hard. Let's just look around. All right. Well, you're at the front of the building. There is this front door which you can't see through, and some windows which you presumably could, though the lights are off. Uh, one of you has dark vision, I believe, though. I think both. I think the only person who doesn't have dark vision is Pam, actually. I don't, I don't have, dark have dark vision either. You I, don't? I think only Ryan No, does. I have oh, God. monochromatic vision. Oh, That's no. not the same thing. Oh, mm. dear. Oh, right. Black and white isn't the same thing as dark in the dark. and light. <laughs> okay, yeah. All right. So um, I'm going to peer inside and see what's going on then. All right. So through the window, you, you can see uh, a strange... You don't recognize this person, but there is strange, tall wolf with a with a gold uh, hood like mask pulled over their head. Fuck. Oh my god! Oh my! God. I don't recognize this person, and so I can't be weird about this. She's wearing uh, she's wearing nothing but uh but briefs, which you might recognize as wrestling shorts if you've ever seen any sort of wrestling in your life. And she's saying, and you can hear her through the window because of your advanced hearing, in the lab up north, you go take... Sorry, it's Alan saying this. In the lab up north, you go take them and leave my city alone. Ah, says the gold-masked woman whose back is turned to you. Thank you for your service to the kingdom of the rats. Alan then spots you. And his eyes go through a series of emotions. Shock, fear, shame. But it's only for a moment as the woman snaps her fingers and the soldier with her fires a shot directly between his eyes. Oh, okay. I can't believe he's fucking dead. I also can't believe he's fucking dead. This is so early for him to be dead. Okay, uh, all right. Oh boy. Okay. Well, I guess I have to jump into action here, huh? All right. <laughs> what? Just through the window? Maybe. Jump the window. <laughs> just smash right through the goddamn Wait, is, window. Wait. Is the window? Does it have glass in it? It's. Can it I is a. It? it is a glass window. It's very slightly ajar, which is no. It's not even ajar. You have the advanced hearing. That's how you could hear through it. Oh my god. Okay. So where's the door? Uh, the door is just off to your right. So oh, the window would be quicker, but in anyway, let's 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 be fairly reasonable about this. Okay, is the door I'm gonna try the door then. I'm gonna I'm gonna uh Um I presumably would have heard a fucking gunshot. Yes, oh, yeah. you have oh, just, both just, heard the uh, gunshot. Yeah. Okay. Uh Alan might be uh, a little bit fucking dead. So can you open this door with me, please? Thanks. Yeah, yeah sure, sure, I'll just smash it. it. Hi Jamie. I do that. Hey Jamie, oh, hey, good Jamie. to see ya. All right, so uh, you're just going to smash open the door? Yep. The door swings open because it's not locked. I fall down. <laughs> Presumably. <laughs> Gold Mask turns around and is utterly caught off guard by your presence, nearly stumbling, but then catching herself on the table. I wrote like five different versions of this, by the way, depending on how you entered. <laughs> she then... They were going to be stealthy. Sorry. Is one of them actually listed as Keystone Cops or... <laughs> Not exactly. (laughs) She then shoes her lackey towards the back, muttering something under her breath. All right, over to Pam now. Uh, Over to Pam now. Pam, meanwhile, stands at the ready in the back. She's beyond any sort of fear now, 
An odd calm rapidly overtook her after she heard that last gunshot. She's completely fine, or else in shock, it's hard to say. But what she can say for certain is that the door to her hiding place is starting to open. Alright, a soldier carrying a gun by his side, as we'll say he's a parrot, <laughs> pushes open the door and starts to step into the dark room where you are. Oh shit, that's bad. This is a bad parrot, right? Yes, this is a soldier parrot. Alright, okay. And one of those round helmets and everything. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> alright, alright, uh... What is my what what is my my uh, situation look like here? Like what's around us here? All right, let's How see. How big is the room? The room is fairly small. It has a couple of locked cells at the back. You are kind of here. Let's uh. All right, I can draw. All right, let's say that the room you're in is about this size. All right. You can set yourself right here. The door that's opening is right here. Grab you, set you here. And the parrot has, is halfway through the door frame. Oh no, that's not good. Mm -hmm. Hasn't seen you yet. You have a chance to react however to, you want to. I have to, I have to weaponize the door to <laughs> uh, knock out the parrot. <laughs> This is very on brand for you. Yep. Yes, and the door it has to be the door has to be taken off and and weaponized as a knockout device. All right, so the door is opening. We'll say it's swinging inwards and towards you. No, it has to be. You can't see the parrot if it's doing that. So that means it has to be open and outwards, which means it's not really in your reach. That's that's too bad. Mm -hmm. What is around me? All right, at the back of the room, there's a couple of doors to, whoops, a couple of doors to cells. And aside from that, there's like, um, we'll say a mop over a here. Mops. There's a, a mop mops right mops. there. And um, that's about it. You don't have gotta, a lot of options. You gotta weaponize the mop as a knockout device. All right. So you're gonna grab the mop and just swing it at him. Yep, activate mob. All right, make an attack roll. Um, Engage yeah. mob. What is the this 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 one? Yeah. Uh, the twenty. Which is this? Wash one. that parrot. Wash or the that one you're holding see? works too. Wash that parrot <laughs> in the healing balm of door wood. Mm-hmm. Now this is a surprise attack. Oh yeah, that's that definitely connects. That connects hard. In fact. Uh, you can roll damage if you want, but either way, that's going to knock him right out. Alright, so does it matter? Uh, if you want to roll damage in case he gets back up later, you can... I rolled damage. You rolled an 8. Yeah, 1d8 works for a, for a mop. Plus your strength bonus, so that's like 10 damage or something. Alright. I did it. You washed that parrot's soul. There. K.O. No, something happens. <laughs> <laughs> you, right. filled, you filled that parrot with the door alright so you have just now from your state of shock unlocked a psionic ability wow I have of course oh, had yeah. you write it on your character sheet already uh, it is for uh, the audience's sake it's called Meditative State. It grants plus one attack, plus four to strike, dodge, and parry for three rounds. Called shots are guaranteed to hit their target area on an 8 plus instead of a 12 plus, and she can now use all of her actions during the duration for attacks, which she couldn't before because she's untrained in combat. Oh, me. All right, so that crack of the mop leads to uh, Gold Mask turning around at the noise. She turns, oh, no. she turns around at the noise, having been certain that the soldier would have been able to take the hiding Fennec hostage. All right, 
how are you feeling at this point in time? How is Pam feeling, and is she ready to step out and fight? Uh, I am ready to, uh, to, uh, let me look at my, let me look at my items real quick. <laughs> All right, yes, it's time to fight. Uh, I have a handgun now. Yeah, nice. you're untrained in it, though, right? Oh, yeah, that's an issue. I have a bolt-action rifle. I have two of them, actually. Uh-huh. So I use one of those. Oh, the, uh, the combat hasn't started yet. Okay. <laughs> so so am I, am I known about right now? She knows you're there. She apparently knew you were there the whole time. All right. <laughs> So Is this you, like step, a... you can step okay. into view, something like that. Uh, yeah, I think uh, I will. I, yeah, okay, I'll step into view, see what's going on here. God damn it! This thing keeps catching my mouse. That is so weird. All right, Pam steps here. You could lock the screen. Yeah, I probably will. Why is my That's, that's something, something that, that the, uh... Oh, that's the MP3 player thing? Yeah, yeah I, don't I don't know why, but for some reason it becomes impossible to change the... Ah! Yeah, <laughs> yeah exactly. Yeah, we'll just remove that MP3 player. It's a bigger hassle than it's worth. It works if you put it, like, all the way on the edge of the table. Alright, in any case... This room is more like this. It's a fairly large area. Um, we'll say that the door is right here. There's also a door at this end. And... Gotta get past those blocks first. Where are Rye and Jasmine positioned, approximately? Okay, so we were at the door... Uh, I presumably Jasmine went in first because she was attempt, uh, either attempting to bust in or pick the lock. I, I, was, trying to, was, I was trying to bust, bust in like an asshole. asshole and then the door just swung open so I fell on my face. <laughs> Again, like an asshole. So I was behind, I'm behind Jasmine wherever Jasmine is currently. Alright. Where's the window that Rye was looking through? That would be like right over here? And I'm going to say there's another one over here. All right. The wolf regains her composure and stands up straight. She's very tall, but Pam still towers over her. Well, this is hardly fair, she says, her voice audibly shaking. She whistles. The Arctic fox silver mask literally drops in from the ceiling, landing next to her. And another, a four-foot-tall spotted mouse in a green mask, dashes in from the side door, screeching to a halt. The three pose in either a dramatic or ridiculous fashion, depending on your point of view. <sighs> Silver, copper, so glad you could join me, says Gold, looking much more confident in her odds. At that moment, Lonnie... Is this a tag team match? <laughs> oh, it's a three on three, so it's a trios match. Oh, yeah. Well, Lonnie is pushing past Rye. Uh, rude, but wait. <laughs> Why is Lonnie here? Uh, because you got her in the truck with you. Right. Lonnie and Maribel both came. These bats are good to have around. That's true. It's Maribel, very true. Maribel is kind of peeking in through the door. Uh, does Maribel have any combat prowess? Why? Tech? She has shoot prowess, so I guess yes. All right. Oh, oh right. right. Lonnie, bad, bad friend. friend. Yes. I, I, I boofed that up. I thought it was the, um, the porcupine that was sick and shouldn't. No, be that's out of Edie. Head. Edie. <laughs> I'm getting there. The Arctic fox silver mask literally drops in from the ceiling, landing next. Okay, we already read that. Like I said, I'm not entirely here. 
Okay. The mouse bellows. The mouse copper mask bellows in a shockingly deep and loud voice. The following no holds barred Texas tornado match is scheduled for total elimination. And the three, well, the remaining two, because Gold Mask had already dropped her cape, tossed their capes aside with a flourish. Oof. Okay, this is weird. I really wish this weren't as weird as it was. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so roll initiative. One of oh, these no, is a 25. Bad. There it is. Plus a 15. Well, well, 16 because the plus one or whatever. I got a 15, and then I'll sign knock stuff over. Okay. And a 12, which isn't awful. Alright, so y'all are all going before the wrestlers. Gonna poke you in the eye with a foreign object. And Lonnie gets a 17. Fuck, all I wanna do. Is poke you in the eye with the foreign object. A foreign <laughs> object. <laughs> Alright, so. Uh, Badroad asked, was the guy that Pam surprised the shoulder that shot the townie? I think yes, yes is the answer to that question. Yes. He, uh, just... he shot Alan. Alan, former, I guess. Sheriff. Yeah, yeah Sheriff. sheriff. Oh. Law enforcement of still waters and now dead horse. Yep. He, so, yeah, uh No, you can go. Oh, oh I was, I was going to say, say that maybe we shouldn't like beat at that too much. <laughs> uh, all right. I, I agree. <laughs> you, you, okay. Uh I was going to mention this, so he's just on the floor somewhere in the general field of combat. This this green thing is Alan. The green thing right there. In fact, let's make Aww. two of them because he's pretty tall and laying down. Two Allens. <laughs> Gee, Bill, your mom lets you have two dead horses? <laughs> no! <laughs> Alright. So, who... Uh, I guess Lonnie got the, got the first initiative, huh? So... Lonnie is going to use her bio manipulation, which means I gotta open up the the rule book. A uh, quick question: We're starting with our totals from last week, right? So, like, I'm still at negative, not negative, <laughs> not yeah, oh, yeah no. negative, That's but bad. <laughs> um, uh, yeah, minus thirteen from whatever my STC is, and also my jacket or whatever the the armor is is like on its last legs okay oh yeah i should probably bring up my character sheet yeah that's important yeah that's a good idea why do i have my screenshots open from past part two it's been three days <laughs> <laughs> it'd be like that sometime all right lonnie uses bio manipulation and the result is Deafness to all three wrestlers, which must be hell for people who like to shout so much. They just like to hear their own voices. Alright. So, they're gonna... Y'all are gonna have a pretty easy round here. I mean, were they going to call out the moves as they were doing them? Well, they get other they get other handicaps because it affects their inner ear. Ah. Uh, All right. All right. So Lonnie he dashes is... over here and squares off, making a a jumping attack at Copper. And just hits. Let's see. Grab a couple D4s here. Sorry, just real quick. I'm going to change Maribel to red so that we don't get her confused with Gold Mask. Okay. And four damage to Copper. 
think. Plus her strength bonus is like plus six, I think. Uh, I need to actually open up her character sheet, huh? It would be helpful, yeah. All right. Um, if I can find the damn thing. I'm so organized. It's been a long day for everyone. Mm. Yeah. I learned from B Bleach that calling your moves makes them stronger. That's what I hear. Sorry, what are we bleaching? <laughs> the the Amine bleach. Oh, right, 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 right. All right. I'm on. I never exported her character sheet from Jimp, so... It's taking a second. I was about to say, I imagine Jimp is what uh, Jim Sterling uses for all of his stuff, but he doesn't make his own stuff. Mm. He, he pays a very talented artist to do that for him. Mm -hmm. Alright, let's quickly export this so I don't have to keep bringing it up. Or to Lonnie. Current Lonnie. Oh, I already apparently have that. I did apparently export it, and I'm just being silly. Alright, current Lonnie. There we go. Alright, so Lonnie's damage bonus is... strength is 20. All right, so she does like an extra... Good lord. She's very strong. That's yeah. the important part. <laughs> <laughs> well, you know, I'm also very strong. Lonnie's mostly just older and has worked out more. All right, I'm... so that's 9, 10, 11, 12. She does... Okay, she just did 19 damage to Copper. Well... Alright. That seems like a lot. Popper's fucking dead. <laughs> um, Did she boop the snoot? She booped the snoot real good. That is a very good news. Alright. And that's her only yeah. attack for this round. And she's done. So who's next? Uh, 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 theoretically me? I was at 12? Yeah. I'm at 16. Alright, so 16 goes, goes next, I guess. Alright. Um, okay, so we have Fox, Wolf, and Mouse. Or Mouse, Fox, and Wolf. Uh, who looks the most speed up, I guess. <laughs> I mean, I guess copper. Um, well, oh. I... Because, mm, mm. you know, he did just get smacked real fucking hard. Just took a whole 19. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think, that's how we, I think that's how we're going to do this. I think we... Well, they we can't hear damage. us. Oh my god, yeah, they can't hear us. So, uh... What I think we should do here is kind of gang up on one person and take them down <laughs> individually and then just kind of go down the line. And that way, yeah, you just kind of you just kind of stack damage. I, I don't know why I'm trying to min-max this encounter, but I feel like it's important. <laughs> um, so I guess I'm going to hit mouse. I guess I'm going to hit some mouse. I'm going to boop that snoot. I'm going to continuously boop that snoot. Sounds uh, like a plan. With my uh Lonnie's in, in range of gun, but gun is stronger and also hmm No, I think it's gun mm. Mm -hmm. I want it to be gun time, but like I it should also be machete time. I think machete time is important. No, it's gun time. Okay. I don't think gun? that's legal in wrestling. <laughs> <laughs> uh 
I, I don't think they're wrestling. I think this is just a to the death kind of situation. Yeah, yeah I, I mean, they did just have a guy killed. They did just kill Alan right there, and I'm I'm a bit peeved about it, even though he he kind of we were, we kind of were at odds for the brief time that I met him. So uh, say hello to my little friend, I guess. All right. Wait, which which friend is your? Listen, I'm not that. I'm not that, I'm not that little, and I don't need your shit. <laughs> I. That's that's not what I. I'm no. sorry, but also that's not what I meant. Uh, this little friend, this little powerful friend. You are also a little powerful. Friend. No, never mind. We're having a. We are in the shoot. middle of a battle. <sighs> I'm shooting them. Okay, that's what's happening. Maybe oh, cool. focus fire on the mouse. They're patiently waiting while y'all talk. Hey, real, uh, real quick, is there, uh, is there like negatives to shooting into a melee in after the bomb? I don't think there are. I'm gonna say that on a miss, there's gonna be a chance to hit uh, an adjacent target. Oh, great. Uh, that's fine. Uh, it's a D20, right? Yeah. Okay. No, I mean, it's not. It's not an over-the-top rope battle royale. It's more. Um... And that's well, a miss. Well, that was a Anime. four. So uh, I really should have gone with the swords. Uh, well, do I have to roll to see if I hit Lonnie, or do you just tell me that I hit Lonnie? Um, I'm gonna say roll a d6, and on a one or two you hit Lonnie, and on a three or four you hit Gold Mask. And on a five or six, you don't hit anyone. I sure hope Lonnie is not hit. Well, I didn't hit anyone, so it's fine. All wow. right. Nice shot. I, well, I do have four more moves. Mm -hmm. so... Four Pam more moves. Four, four more moves. moves. Let's Pam try that definitely one. the big friend <laughs> Uh Because if I go over there, I'm going to get tag teamed uh, by the, the, the wolf and fox and mouse physically. So that's a problem. So let's try this gun one more time, and then I'm going to think about things. I'm going to think about my life and what I've done. Um, where is the D20? There it is. Okay. And that's a well, 16. That's better. Much, that's much better. better. Okay. Uh, damage for that is actually... I was looking it up because we were being... Uh, where did I put that? Yeah, it's... 2d4, I think, actually. Yeah. Um, it's 2d4 or 2d6? 2d4, uh, 4d4 on a three-round burst. Okay. You didn't call a three-round burst, so... Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so, 2d4 it is. Battle Royale with cheese. There you go. It's four altogether. All right. Four damage. Just, just winged him. Yeah, I don't like, I don't like gun. I've decided. I think I'm, I'm very used to, to, to stabbing implements, and this is not getting the job done in the way that I would like. Yeah, the smaller guns are mostly just to keep your distance. The bigger guns are pretty powerful. <laughs> okay, so I have three moves left. Um, if I were to close the distance and. Stab. Would that be one move or two? Uh, that's going to be either two moves or a jumping attack. No, well, I mean, it's not the first move of the round, so it would have to be a jumping. So I'm going to... Uh, yeah, this is... Yeah, question. Uh, if I right, say you couldn't do my... a jumping attack because you already attacked. Okay. Yeah. Um, if I were to save my moves, would I then be able to use them to parry for other people or like i mean if you're in the right in, position in tandem if i'm in the right position yeah okay. like if you want to move up next to someone then we can yeah like if jasmine wants to use me as a springboard to do something like silly like if i want to uh, or like if i just want to move into position and give someone a helping hand in their attack role or something you know what the best part of being a game master is to me being Hold able to just being able to just make up the rules as I go along. Because <laughs> there's no mechanics for this stuff. <laughs> but That's yes. after the bomb, eh? Uh-huh. Yeah, because I don't... No, you can go. 
I'm um, um, just saying, it's not like 3.5 uh, Dungeons and Dragons where almost everything you can do is meticulously plotted out in terms of die rolls. Uh huh, and you can't find anything in those damn books either. <laughs> All right. Um, so what do you want to do? You've got three three moves left. Yeah, I'd like to save all of them for either parries or assistance. All right. Uh, are you going to use one of them to move up next to someone so you can actually do that? Mm, all right, then. Yeah, sure. All okay, right. Okay, so I just, just, just meander, just scramble in the general area of Lonnie and Pam and also Dillo. <laughs> all right. Now... I like spinning Pam. That's a good effect. It's very, very. Oh no! <laughs> it's, uh -oh. it's gone. It's gotten away. Oh no! Oh no! She's possessed. Busy read. All right. So that makes it Jasmine's turn, I think. Uh, yeah. Okay. So. Uh, if we recall last time, I was loath to shoot these people. Mm -hmm. Last time on tail. Last time on tail. Uh, I was loath to shoot the silver and gold mask because they seemed to not know where they were and kind of like set the rules of the the rules of the engagement as to just be a wrestling match. And then when I got a pin, they ran away. This one started with them shooting a whole horse. Mm-hmm. An entire horse. An entire horse. So we're we're done with that. We're Sounds just gonna, good. We're, we're just gonna, gonna shot a gun. <laughs> I do have a whole shotgun. Mm -hmm. So I'm gonna roll that as soon as I remember which strata of my desktop my character sheet is living on. There it is. Small animal, big gun. Small animal, barg gun. Nope. That's, come here. Uh, I am fire. Nope. It's a twenty. I don't need to grab the fucking tens. Uh, rolling to shoot with this shotgun at copper, I guess. Okay. Since we've decided we're gonna stack damage on the little one, which mm -hmm. seems mean. It's certainly a heal 18. move. Eighteen. Yeah, yeah. They All shot right. our horse. We have to shoot their mouse. They did shoot a whole horse. Uh. We can shoot an entire mouse. It's fine. All right. Um, roll damage, because he's not even going to try and dodge something like that, because he's got, like, a minus six to dodge right now. All right, so that's 2d6. Yeah. And we come out with six. All right. And... Um, I have more moves. I might as well empty this gun. Well, so, I, I should have. I meant to bring up a big list of wrestler quotes to have Copper shout, and I completely forgot to do it. Do you know? Do you know some that you can uh, make up? If I could, if I could be serious for a moment. <laughs> that's a that's a ten. I don't feel great about that one. Mm, all right, a ten. He would still have to roll a. Sixteen? No, he's got. He'd still need to roll a fourteen to dodge that. Uh, I think he's just gonna take it. All right. I can't believe he's dead. I can't believe I fucking killed him. Not yet. We'll, we're getting there. We will get there. Oh, went we're across the field. Oh, oh, nasty. Yeah, eleven is pretty hype. Uh huh. He's uh starting to look a little worse for wear now. I know plenty of wrestler quotes, I just don't know what Katie wants in terms of, like, tone. Let's Ridiculous. Macho Man and this? Warrior stuff. <laughs> there, no, there we go. Thank you, Mox. You found it. <laughs> that's, that's the perfect wrestling quote. It works because he can't hear himself. Uh, oh my god, you're right. <laughs> It just, it just sounds like Bobcat, Bobcat Goldthwait. Mm hmm. Except he's a mouse, so field mouse Goldthwait. <laughs> Alrighty. So, you still got three more moves left. I think your gun only holds two shells at a time. 
Uh, uh yeah, that's, that's why, why I said empty the gun. Alright. Do you have any strategy that uh, you want to yell out while they can't hear us, I guess? Oh, can we retcon the fact that I used my first move to stand up? The what? That I used my first move to stand up. Yeah, I, yeah, that makes I rushed sense. In Cause you were prone. Alright, so you've got two more moves. Uh, I'm going to- I don't, I have four oh, one moves more. in total. You have so one more I'm, move. Yeah, so I'm going to hold that for dodging. Okay. Now it's Pam's turn. Pam is in an advantageous position. Yeah, Pam no one has, knows. Pam has a big old buff and is behind everyone. Yeah, that's that's a, that's a good advantage there. Mm-hmm. And you have... Wrestling skills. Yep. And four, four actions, all of which can be used to attack if you want to. All right, uh... So there's four actions, and there's four... There's, there's Lana, three. There's three. Yeah. Uh-huh. So we're all doing... We're all, we're all getting up on this, this green one here, yeah? Seems that way. All right, so... I hate that it does that when I'm holding the button down. <laughs> <laughs> Is that because you're holding alt? Yeah, then it starts to the other axis. Amazing. Look at that, my stuff. Oh, that's trippy. If I hold down alt and then move my cursor over something, it zooms way in on the object. Alright, so I uh, can use the rifle butt as a weapon on the small mouse. Alright. Am I close enough? Do I have to move? You probably want to move, but it's since it's just one space, it can be one action. Alright. I gotta find a find a dice. <laughs> I figure you're here. close enough that that's fair. Shaky, shaky, shaky. Oh, went a little bit. That looks real good. Thirteen, 13. plus four from your state, so that's a seventeen. And then I gotta do this one, and I think. Yeah. If if she knocks the mouse out, then maybe we won't kill kill them. So I think this might be a good move on Pam's part. Mm -hmm. They shot a whole horse. Six damage. Yes, but but Pam's still kind of weird about murder. I think maybe. That's right. I haven't I haven't talked to her yet. Y'all don't even know what around. you two don't even know what happened to her or what she's been up to. So. Yeah, so as far as I know, Murder's still technically off the table, as long as she's looking at it. <laughs> yeah, it's like a reverse, uh, uh, Schrodinger's cat. Alright, um, what's your next move, Pam? Oh, uh, yes, okay, uh, so I'm, I did six damage, right? Yeah. And um, what's, what's the status here? What do you mean? So they're they're just still standing there, right? Yeah, they y'all are just piling on, and they're fucking haven't gotten the chance to move yet. They're still stunned by their inner ears getting fucked up. All right, so I have to try using the gun butt again. Okay, just bam. Just yep. smushing that snoot. Oh, that poor snoot. Oh, that's a good hit. And then this one. Trick shot. Four damage. Parkour. Parkour! Did I have one more, right? You have two more. Oh, okay. Because uh... you right, have so... a bonus action from your uh, psionics. Alright, alright. Uh... And I do have wrestling skills, right? Yep, you can, can absolutely just, like, go wrestling. Total body slam right here. I would, rec from your position, I would say you can use two moves to grapple and then slam him. Alright, that sounds good. Alright, so, attack roll to entangle. Seven, alright. That he is actually going to try to avoid. Which means he needs to roll an eleven or better. Probably something that, like, feels natural to do uh -huh. for him, yeah? Yep. Oh, does not well, succeed. Well, it's not I can't a tie believe because this of the. Uh... Is about to be fucking dead. Yeah. All right. 
And now an attack roll to body slam. Six. Six? No, you need to do an attack roll for the body slam, not a damage roll. Uh, this one. Yeah. Seventeen. Seventeen. Well, yeah. Oh, yeah, that'll do it. That definitely does it. So this happened, then it's just... <laughs> yeah, exactly yeah, like that. that. <laughs> that's, that's exactly it. I'm We're... surprised that stayed. <laughs> We're going to say that now copper is prone and also you should roll, uh, you should roll, I think, 1d6 damage for the body slam. Okay. Uh, d6. This is the, this is the d6, right? Yeah. No. It's the one with the pips on it. The one I, The six-sided die. This, this, this one. Oh, yeah. Okay. So I oh. forget that there's six sides. <laughs> Does it look like a cube? <laughs> Like, this interest no one, but I see that move as being Ooh, like a Uranaki. Uh, what's your damage bonus? You have plus one damage, right? I do. I have to look. Is it. Where would that be under? Uh, under damage bonus. <laughs> Just what a about second. the strength? The strength bonus? Yeah, it's your physical strength bonus. Okay, so that's. My physical strength is 26. Uh, wow, your physical strength is that high? I. Yeah, after all my. The buff things. Big repeat. Uh huh. Yeah, twenty six. You're right. So that means you get, I think, plus ten damage. Something it's like that. Seventeen Big plus two plus two reeds. plus five is why it's twenty six. Okay. Um. Terrifyingly strong reed. Uh huh. She's almost as strong as Lonnie. <laughs> I need to find that bonus table. Here, here it is. I think. It's here somewhere, damn it. I went by it. There it is. Physical strength, 26, gets plus 11 damage. My god, this mouse is dead. Mm. Hey, Katie, oh, no. don't torture this mouse this way. This mouse is dead. So that's 50. You rolled a 1? A 1, yeah. Alright, so that's um, 12 damage. Just choke slam this mouse straight to hell. Uh huh. And he is prone now. And now it's time for, now it's time for them to fight back. All right. So Pam is also prone I'm from trying. the body slam. That's close enough. <laughs> All right. Gold mask shakes it off first, and immediately goes for the grapple on Pam. Rolling. Oh, that was a good roll there. It just kind of fell. Uh, let's see, minus it. So that's a that that is a hit. That is a hit because she's got minus six and then she's got plus four. No, plus two. All right. So real quick, they're not obviously armed. No. Right. They're not strapped. They're just. Coming at us with their bare hands. Yep. Shit, that's and, and wolf hands. Yep. Uh, Gold does have a thing strapped to her belt, but you can't really tell what it is in the mayhem. It could be a sandwich. It's lunch. <laughs> it could be a sandwich. All right. Um, Pam has no actions left, so you can't dodge or parry. And I can't do anything here for her. And. Uh, yeah, you're not really in position. Are you in position to, to parry for her? I guess you might be close enough with your tail shield. Oh, that is true. Well, I can't Captain America it, but, uh... Is that not a skill you can get? So if you want to try and parry that, you need to roll an 8 or better to parry for Pam. I will attempt to parry for Pam. All right. Where have I thrown my d20? Oh, here it says. Okay, wait, let me, let me just check. Oh, that's the 16. 16. Oh, yeah. And do shields have SDC? Uh, yeah, hold on. Where is the sheet? Uh, yeah, 50 SDC on a successful parry. All right. It's her attack strength. All right. 
She does to your shield 17 damage. That's cool. That's fine. This is this is what I'm here for. All right. She is then going to spin around angrily towards uh, Rye here. That tracks. <laughs> this is fine. And now she's going to need to roll a 12 or better or get very, very ill and just kind of stumbles backwards, losing the rest of her turn. Uh, uh, (laughs) Her inner ear is fucked. Oh, right. (laughs) And (laughs) like I said, this first round is going to be pretty easy on y'all. All right. Now, Silver's turn. Is going to be a rush towards Armor Armadillo over here. Nope. (laughs) And a leaping attack. Or... That's only a six. You could... If you have any actions, you can probably dodge it's, or parry that. Oh, I was saying, I was about to say, it takes a 10, but it's probably not a 10. Uh, that, yeah, that comes out You're, to uh, 8. Cause they have, yeah, because they have a negative. Oh, right, your SDC. Your uh, natural SDC. So, yeah, that just pings off your, uh, pings off your shell. And that was his leaping attack, so now he's going to hop over to the wall here. And uh, climb up to it. All right. Up at the ceiling. I've got my eye on you. Bill. Bill. All right. So as the round is ending, gold mask. Hang on. Hmm? I don't know, like rafters. <laughs> All right. <laughs> uh, as as the round ends, gold mask slaps the device on her belt. Oh no, that's bad. And immediately, Lonnie clutches her head and stumbles over against the wall. What, what the fuck did you do? <gasps> hey, stop that! <laughs> Four versus three is hardly a fair fight. I'm just evening the odds. I'll even your odds. Don't you worry about it. <laughs> just... Oh, so angry. You just... All right, so uh, roll initiative for the... Oh, I guess Copper's still got to go, but Copper is just pinned under Pam, so I don't think he's going to do shit this round. <laughs> um, if he wasn't feeling sick, he'd attempt to get out, but now the next round Could is even. starting. So roll initiative. Well, no, well, 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 I'm not going to be participating much until very late. I got 15. I got a 2. Well, so it's a 3. Uh, 17. 17. All right, they got a five. They got the plus one. And Lonnie gets nothing, because oh, no. she's she's not able to participate. <sighs> All right, so what's the order? I got fifth, 15. 17, so I'd be at the top. All right, Very so last. Dead Jasmine... Last. Pa- Jasmine, then Pam, then the wrestlers, then Rye. Yep, yep. All right, sounds good. Jasmine, your move. Uh, so can't take, take any more shots in the mask because mask is under Pam, and I don't. Yeah, that's, that's probably a bad, bad play. play. Very. Um, I'm gonna drop focus. my. I'm sorry. No, I was just saying focus some more fire. I don't know. Yeah. Uh. So here's what's gonna happen. I'm gonna point my my cool, cool pistol that I have at Silver Mask up. I can see them in the rafters, right? It's yeah. not like Batman shadowed. He's not invisible. Cool. So I'm just gonna point my pistol up at Silver Mask and say, "Hey, get the fuck down from there!" <laughs> shoot <Nope>. wildly. <laughs> I, I shoot wildly. I will shoot again. All right. Dance. Oh, dang! Your I'm pistol. Done. Your yep. pistol misfires. Yep. And uh, That's bad. That's you're very gonna bad. 
you 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 can take a couple of actions to un to unfuck it. I forgot the word for that. Unjam it? Yes, jam unjam it. Unjammer Lammy? You can take a couple moves to unjam it, but that's gonna be the rest of your turn. It will it will be literally the rest of my turn. Ah, oh, shit. Now, yes, yes, I spend a point of grit to clear the jam. <laughs> <laughs> Gunslinger class was, uh, in D&D is fucking bonkers. Mm-hmm. It's the counter psi unit. Ah, oh, Bad Road nailed it. Doesn't seem to be affecting Pam, though. Of course, no one knows that Pam has a psi except for maybe Pam. Oh, oh, right, I was going to make a joke about how she had a fever, but it's gone now. <laughs> oh! <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so what are your last two actions? I'm, uh, like I said, I'm going to unclear the... Okay, you're going to clear the jam? I'm going to clear the jam, because fuck. Alright, right, uh, Pam's turn. Alright, alright, so the issue is, is I don't want to un... Uh, I, have to, I have to take care of mouse. Can I punch to uh, knock out? Uh, oh, just uh, try and punch out copper with a with a knockout blow. Yeah. All right. Yeah, I think you can. I'm gonna say that that's gonna be the. Yeah, I'm gonna say you're gonna need to get a pretty hefty, uh, pretty hefty hit to do that though. All right. In order to, it it probably won't be a knockout, is what I'm saying. But you can like ten punch him. Gonna do a cool trick shot and get. <laughs> Uh, critical <clears throat> roll. Ten punch. Jesus Christ. That is eighteen. Well, well, okay, that's that's very not bad. And it was a cool uh, throw too. All right. Um, he can't dodge, but he's gonna try to parry. Uh, sixteen plus four. That is a successful parry. Wait, you've also got plus four, so that is not a successful parry. Wow. Well, wow. <laughs> So you may have to remind me if I forget your bonuses. All right. So that's just a, a straight fucking shot across the face. Roll, roll to roll, roll damage on your uh, unarmed strike, which I think is one d one d four plus your strength bonus, which is eleven. Knockout boop. Ooh, oh, oh shit! Seventeen. That's, that's very good. Oh no. Oh no, I can't believe this. That's so good. Like it's very that. good. Uh-huh. <laughs> this this mouse is taking a lot of damage and has not gotten to shout a lot. <laughs> I'm sorry we keep doing this. <laughs> it's good because I'd forgotten to get that list of wrestler quotes. So now I don't have to, you know, come up with wrestler quotes for him. You can make some <laughs> <laughs> All right, you've still got uh, three more actions. Okay, uh, so the mouse is the mouse taken care of now. Is that is that is that settled? Is that done? Hmm. The mouse is still awake. You okay, haven't knocked so him out yet. That's the problem. Uh huh. I have how many more? Three. Yeah. All right, so I'm gonna try that again. All right. Does the bonus I mean... stack? Is it concussive? <laughs> Did you mean to say concussive? Yes. It's, cer it's certainly concussive. Seven plus four, so that's an eleven. Seventeen. All right. He grabs your hand. Yeah, this isn't gonna work. I think I'm gonna stop doing that. And you are now successfully entangled. So what now y'all are in a now y'all are in a wrestling, standing, wrestling, grappling position. Wow. And, well, I guess you're on in a laying down grapple, which means that his entangle just put him on top of you. Okay. Th is... This mouse is really small, right? He's pretty small, but he's really strong. Okay, so that's a, that's, that's a problem. Are there... Um, I don't I don't know a lot of wrestling moves. What are the ones that help out in this kind of situation? <laughs> uh, monkey flip would be good. And that's where you just <laughs> toss him off of you, basically. I would love, can I aim my toss at Golden Mask? You can try. That's gonna take a, that's gonna take a real good roll, though. All right. All right. That is eleven plus four. Uh, yeah, I think that'll do it. Oh, cool. All right. 
Copper flies through the air, shouting, and Gold is going to successfully catch him and place him on the ground. Oh no! That's, and they that's, both square up again. That's Aww. the bad. That's the bad thing that happens. <laughs> All right, so you have one more action left. You can save it, or you can uh, go down, go out there swinging. Uh, is what? Is there any objects near me? I mean, there's the door right next to you. <laughs> <laughs> can I pick up the door and throw it? Uh, I think you'd have to use. You could use an action to rip it off its hinges, but you wouldn't have time to do anything else. I'm gonna get that door so All I can right. save it for later. All right. Uh, with your 26 strength, I'm gonna, not even going to make you roll for that. We all know that you're going to wreck the door. <laughs> <laughs> all right, now it is their turn. All right. Gold Mask is going to... Hmm. All right, so you're holding the door. Rye is over here, squared That's off. <laughs> I'm going to get that door so I can save it for later. That is a good quote. <laughs> All right. Uh, Jasmine is over here unjamming her gun. And... Clutching about doing tiny swears. <laughs> I'll be right back real quick. Oh, well, that means I can't have her attack you. Okay, I can do it quick. I have to use the bathroom. So. All right. We can wait. Don't worry. Oh, I should take advantage of this lull in the action to go get my beer out of the freezer. That's a good idea. As well, Raw rolls on. <laughs> During the break, our fighters took the opportunity It's not like Pam has actions left to parry. Yeah, that's very true. Well, I guess I'll go acquire water then, since we're doing this. All right. Then I, too, will uh, be right back. Uh, stick with us, folks. Going to be just a sec. All right, I'm back. We're back. All of us. Uh, someone talk so I can make sure it's working. Amazingly, it is not. That's fucking incredible. Uh, I don't know how that happened. Oh, that's why. Okay, that makes sense. Thank you. I keep clicking the... I keep clicking my frame instead of... Okay, now it should work. Someone talk? Do want to talk. All right. Awesome. I think most streamers who, like, have the capability have internal capture cards. We have this, like, external thing just because we needed something to plug the Switch and the Xbox into. Yeah. It's, I mean, not everyone uses an internal. I personally prefer the external ones because they're easier to transfer between rigs. Uh, it's a, but if you're getting an external one, definitely get a, three, a USB 3 card because there's a huge delay on the USB 2 cards. My my secret is, is that I think all my USB non motherboard USB parts are unplugged because I think they might be broken. Oh, fun! <laughs> all right. Of all the decisions I've heard about Vince making, that's one of them. Ah, about the yeah, <laughs> about we were talking the, about the no action during commercial breaks thing anymore. Ah, uh, all right. Well, back to the show. Copper is gonna be all. Is going to be all, oh yeah, you don't disrespect the Lucha Libre. I don't know. Rises to the top. The mouse rises to the top. I am coming through your mic real bad. Uh, I'm also coming through your mic. That's a thing that happens. Ah, well. All right. Gold Mask is going to attack the door Pam is holding with, uh, with a forceful chop. Oh no, that's not good. My door. I hope my door is okay. Uh, well, the door is definitely going to take some damage. Oh no.
The door is going to uh, break in half. Do I have two pieces now? Like separate pieces? <laughs> I'm going to say that they probably fall out of your grasp. Oh, no. Because of just the force of the blow. So let me see. There's another. That door is too far away to get. Oh, no. <laughs> karate mouse? Like, what? Is, what is, oh, God. This is gold. This is this is karate wolf. Is the wolf here now? The wolf is the wolf is pretty close to you. Okay. All right. She's now going to uh, go for a grapple on you, which you don't have moves left to parry, I believe. So, unless she rolls the like a four. The door was my parry, and it broke. <laughs> All right. That's eleven, and now she is going to Irish whip you to the west. And, well, let's see, that does, she's got plus four to hit, she's got plus two to hit. So that's actually a miss, and she fumbles it, and you're able to keep your grip on her arm. You don't have any actions to counter it, so instead she's just going to try and bring you back around and clothesline you. How uh, big is this wolf compared to Pam? She's probably about a foot shorter. Okay. So that's pretty relevant size-wise, what we have there. Alright, she just barely is- she is not rolling good. These these guys are like the unluckiest wrestlers. I guess that's what they get for being comedy heels, right? <laughs> oh god, they're the fucking B-team. <laughs> okay, and she's going to clothesline you real good for... I guess that counts as a one, even though it's on edge. So she's going to clothesline you real good for 16 damage and knock you to the ground. Also, you've technically oh, switched sides because of that first attempt at throwing. What was, uh, baby, what was that crew called? Which one? Uh, Heath Slater and Bo Dallas and Curtis Axel and them. Oh, God. Um, was that the social outcasts you're talking yes. about? They, these guys are a bit social outcasty. <laughs> How much damage did I take again? I, I have to. I have you to took try. sixteen damage. And I'm at fifty, right? It reset or something, right? I didn't take any damage before. I don't think I actually. I know. Did I not take any damage last time? I, you didn't. I think you're the only one who managed to get out of the last one without any damage. That whole time. The, yeah. Sorry. What was the number again? Sixteen. Was, okay. So that'd put you at thirty-four SDC, I think. And as you hit the ground, Gold Mask goes for a stomp. Oh no. And this time actually rolls well. And that's another 14 damage. Oof, okay. Now they're stacking damage. It's not as fun when they do it. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Silver Mask is going to take an incredible leap towards Jasmine. You're gonna miss because I can't dodge. Two plus four. Well, oh, completely whiffs it. Lands on the ground, winded. Um, you are right there, but wait, no, I don't care about you. Never mind. Just. Oh, wow. Wow. <laughs> Copper, meanwhile, puts his foot on Pam's chest and pumps up his arms. He's he looks he looks a little he looks a little uh, more confident now. Just Oh. I'm worried I'm going to get getting in. the crowd to cheer for him. I was really <laughs> sure you were going to say that he looks a little concussed. <laughs> <laughs> that too. He looks a little less concussed, actually. Um, just a sec. And oh wow, that's a that's a good roll. Okay, yeah, he looks a little less concussed now. However, that has used up his entire turn, and uh... now it is Rise's turn. Are they like liches that, that derive energy from the crowd or something? <laughs> the imaginary crowd. 
Oof. Okay, so he used, uh, uh, he used a health potion. Based his flask. Um, All right. Anyone who has streetwise, please roll that. I can roll that. I think. Let me check. I can roll that. I have the opposite of streetwise, and it's wilderness survival. Mm. It's like, um, it's uh, a thirteen. It's a. Uh, it is definitely not a thirteen. It's a thirteen. <laughs> Six plus seven is thirteen. That's true, but sixty plus seven. Uh, yeah, that's different, huh? Uh, and I think Jazz is the only one with Streetwise. Yeah, I don't, I don't, I don't know anything about people. Uh, yeah, I think Jazz I, is I the, only, only, yeah. the only one who would be able to identify what happened there, and she didn't. So. Oh well. We'll work. We'll beat it out of them. Anyway, uh, all right. So I have to. I have to get. I have to get Pam out of this situation. Mm -hmm. So so. Okay. So what is what are the physical positions of what's going on again? Well, just what it shows on the board. You're over here. Copper's got his foot on Pam's chest, and uh, Gold just finished stomping on Pam. Okay, so Gold's the beefier, the beefier target here. Yeah, she's the biggest of the three. Well, okay, me, where am I on the board here? Okay, so either I leap for the first thing and hope that the dice don't betray me again, or I just straight up stab or I shoot. Huh. Okay. You're close enough that you'd be able to take uh, your swings at Copper, no problem. Maybe, ah, probably Gold as well. Okay, um, I should probably go for gold then. Okay. Uh, all right. Um, go for the gold. Okay. Yeah, let's go with let's go with machetes, I guess. Okay. I'm going to stab. I'm going to leap and stab. Let's try the leap first, because I then would have three actions, and that's fine. Uh, where's that d20? Where have we gone? All right. So. Just a series of machete attacks. Eleven, yeah. Machete. Uh, uh, Eleven. Gold has one action and is going to try and dodge. Hey, Mox, right now are you drawing an outline around this dead horse? No, that's I would not do that. <laughs> <laughs> All right, the uh, she does not manage to dodge, and your machete cuts oh, true. I I didn't mean Xenon. I'm sorry. I did say Mox. So I had meant Xenon. <laughs> uh, where is my... I, did I bring my... Did I cart my damage dice over? I feel like I did. Where have they gone? Over here. I... Yes, thank you. Here, I'll bring them over. There you go. Well, one of them, one of them's gone now. Uh, so, um, I don't. Where did it come back? Right, right it's, here. It was a four. It's 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 a four altogether. Okay. So that's four. Do you have? You don't have any bonus physical strength bonus, right? Mm, yeah, I'm just at fifteen. Um, was that one machete with the leap attack, or was that both? Uh, I'm gonna I say attack again with the other machete because of the dual uh, wield. Yeah. All right. Um, where has it gone? There it is. Please stop! Oh, well, no, it's gone now. It's, it's coming back. It's fine. Uh, it's, it's a hit. That's good. I don't know what it is, and I don't know where it is, and that's fine. It'll stay where it is. It's a, it's a five, so it's just barely a hit, but roll damage. All right. Uh, I, I should have, I should have. I should have reunited these these two friends. Okay, come here, come here, love. We're going to do this. Well, that's a three. All right. Oh well, that's fine. That's seven. Mm hmm. That is not a bad hit. 
All right. Well, wait. I have more actions. Oh heck. Yeah. Oh, so heck. you can I like. Have more actions. You're also this... in the in the back, so you don't have to worry about like dodging or anything. You can use your tail to entangle. You could move around. You could. Uh, how how he? You said the mouse was less concussed. Yeah, the mouse we... is looking a lot healthier than before. Do we all have to? Is this like a wow raid? And we all have to bring them down to zero at the same time, or else I'll just keep wrapping each other up. <laughs> Listen, I'm I'm very concerned about the mechanics that you've introduced here. Okay. Um. Hmm. I would like to pistol whip with my shield. Okay. And then, well, it wouldn't make sense for me to pin because I don't, I don't, I'm not a wrestle, I'm not a wrestle cat. I'm a pass cat. Those are two mm. different things. Okay. So, what do I have to roll for hit? For hit? For to hit with shield? Um, I um. guess you just need to roll a five or a higher. What is what is what's the damage on that? On a shield, I think it's just like 1d4. Mm. So if I were to if I were to if I were to hit with the machetes, um, that would be two at once as opposed to the one of the of the. Yes, that's how we're calling that. Okay, yeah, then I'll just do another attack. Um, where where have you gone? There we are. Okay. All right, well, that's, that's a hit. A, it's a, that, that's a hit. Yeah, it, it hits. That's legit. <laughs> roll that oh, calculator. No. <laughs> that's roll. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's there now. Okay, that's a seven. That's better. Okay. All right, and so then... I would have three moves left. I'm going to. Uh, I'm in front of. I'm in front of Fox Friend, right? Uh, Arctic, oh. oh, Fox Friend, then, yeah, yeah, she's, she's prone. Oh, okay, uh, what about Fox Enemy? Fox Enemy is over by Jasmine, you probably won't be able to reach and attack him, but he's also uh, prone. Oh, yeah, okay, oh, yeah, he's fine, he can stay there, okay, so I'm gonna, all right. I'm gonna um, push like... sugar on him. <laughs> I'm going to wrap my tail around, uh, not Fox, Wolf Friend. Okay. And she's very strong, so that's not going to work out the way that I want it to. Um, um, mostly I'd like to destabilize her so I can, uh, so when I do my next attack, I can see if I can knock her prone. All right. Roll to entangle, I guess, at her legs then? I'm always thinking about this in a, like, in a fulcrum kind of way, like a, like a, like a teeter totter kind of tall people situation. I don't think that's the way physics works. Well, I'm going to say that you... that uh, she's already off balance from being struck. So if you can roll to entangle her legs, you can knock her down. Nope. Well, no, it's it's fine. Where did it go? Where did it land? I Here. think... Is it... Oh, wait. That's an 18. Well, that'll do it, I think. Unless she's very strong, which she is, in fact, very strong. Oh, oh, I know. Okay, let's... Uh... There is a lot of people just on the ground right now. This really is a lucha match. She's, she's on the ground now, right? Um, <laughs> I have two moves left, I think. Mm -hmm. Okay, I want to stomp on the box, on the bad box. On the bad box, making the bad sounds that are making Lonnie hurt. Um. Or stab it. I don't know. Blow it to up. I think. Yeah, I mean, Blow you can you can try can and I, grab for it. Can I pour antidote on it? <laughs> Anti it's the antidote. Yeah. Can oh, I, you don't I, have I, you don't have more doses of that with you. No, no that not had the, to stay at the lab. Not the, not <laughs> not the anti not the stimulant and not the not the antidote you're thinking of. The Go antidote. Drown. <laughs> Yeah, the antidote that um, was for the Lonnie poison that I then used. I never had an opportunity to use the actual point, the actual antidote, because Lonnie never betrayed us. Oh, that's so, right. You still have that. I, still I mean, have... yeah, you can try and you can try and pour that on it while she's prone. I would very much like to do that. Okay. I would like to hurt the bad box that is making my bat friend feel bad. <laughs> 
All right, um, you probably don't even need to roll for that since she's prone. You uh, pour out the liquid all over the box. It, you can't tell if it really had any effect. But it's well, wet now. Was <laughs> lying, the effect, effect was, was it's, it's wet, wet now. now. Yep. Bonnie's <laughs> not looking any better. No, she's still out like a light. Oof. All right, well, at least she will be less pain? Maybe. It's wet now, so I don't know. Um, okay, I have one move left. I'm going to save that for Perry so we can do... Wait, this is the last... Yeah, this, this is, is the, the last. The round, yeah. This is the end of the round. Okay, so I'm just going to clock her in the, in the, in the, in the suit then. All right. I'm going to use my... Open hand punch. <laughs> my, yeah, my 3D6 SDC power punch is what's going to happen here. I'm very angry. San Diego Comic Con? <laughs> <laughs> no, that's yeah. SDCC. No, I mean, oh. basically. All right, let me let me get one of these things and hope this goes well. Wow, you're you sure are rolling a lot of minimal rolls. Yeah, that sure is a lot of five, huh? Uh huh. Um, I mean, it does connect, so there is. That. Yeah, that is that is a connect. I'm going to roll the... Th Wait, does she have... She doesn't have any moves to, to dodge. No. Oh, well, that's 3d6. Let's have this happen. And... Well, okay. <laughs> and you backflip <laughs> away. <laughs> it's nine. So it's a nine altogether. All right. Nine damage. She does I not... She doesn't look too happy about it. Shit. Hmm? Nothing. I'm getting confused because I thought Xenon had a green hand. <laughs> um. Do I, do I not? I thought I did. Do you, do you not? This is mine. It looks pretty green to me. Mox's hand is also like blue green. Teal. <laughs> it is different. If you change your color 50 times, you get an achievement. <laughs> Fun. <laughs> party, party. Um, all right, round three. Check out that initiative order. I have to do some. I have to do some uh, game yeah, right. modification. Uh, so that's suboptimal because I rolled a three. I fucked up my die. <laughs> it's purple now. Worst things have happened. It. Well, again, so... Also I'm, a three? I'm, no, a two. Well, yeah, also a three. So I'm here now, again. It's fine. Die. All die right. of fucking destruction. Giant die. Eleven, alright. And the masks get... The masks go first. Yeah, that's, that's that's not going to end well at all, is it? That's fine. Okay, well, at least they're all going first, as opposed to me being right at the very end and still not getting to fucking capitalize on the guy passed out in front of me. Mm-hmm. All right. Gold Mask is able to... Yes. Because uh, Silver Fox is Envy... Or Silver Mask is Envy. All right. She gets up. And she takes a good hard swing at Rye. That's fine. That's uh, cool. She's got a six, so it would be pretty easy to parry or dodge that if you want. If I had any rolls left. Wait, do it's, I? Yeah, you have all your rolls well, back. Oh, wait, yeah. Oh, heck. Okay, well, I'll try then, I guess. Oh, no, it's gone. No, it's, you... it's, it's always gone. Oh, it's... that's a good quote. Oh, no. Well, I don't do that. I very much don't do that. Oh, no. Because that's a two. <laughs> so I don't <laughs> Another do one. Yeah, this is... I don't I don't know why my dice don't like... Don't like. They don't like. All right. I haven't even done any murder with you. I literally have not done any murders with you. Why are you being like this? Uh, she punches you solid in the chest. Open-handed strike for 15 damage. That's that's cool. I can I can take that. It also causes Fairly you to stumble easily. back, which she also steps forward as it happens. And 
and she takes another open-handed strike at you. That's fine. It's fine. It's cool. This time she gets 20. Well! Non-natural 20, just oh, regular okay. 20. Okay. An unnatural 20. An eldritch 20. And... Why is it never called that? Like, for real? <laughs> An Eldritch 20? Yeah. That would Maybe be great. Another 15 damage. That's that's less fine, but also, also acceptable. Alright. And again, you stumble backwards. She uh, pulls her hand back, flexes her muscles, blows on her fist, and takes a wild swing at you. Wow. All right, she rolls an 11. Uh, you, which do you want to try and dodge or uh you want to try and counter uh, that in some way? <laughs> can I parry it? You can. Okay, I'm going to attempt to parry it cuz cuz this is What's the bonus to fun. parry on the shield? Uh uh, I have a natural bonus. I have a plus one to parry okay. generally. I think the shield gives you another plus one. The shield just gives me a, a 50 SCC on a successful parry, so I don't know if that... Uh... Yeah, the shield The shield is what adds the plus one uh, parry. Okay. Yeah. So Okay, so you've got to roll a 10 or better. They're gone again. Right here. Ooh, ooh, that's well, a nine plus that, one. That's, 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 that's not it, though. That's very Because you needed it. That is just, just barely. That's just so it's a, We're just having a bad day. It's been a long day. It's fine. All right, 15 damage, and you're knocked over. Yeah, that's fine. It's, 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 I need to calculate that damage because it's probably not fine. 40, it's 45 fine. damage total. Oof. Okay. That's not good. Oh, wait, I can solve that problem. Okay, it's fine. You've got potions. Yeah, I've got potions. It's fine. It's just... At this point, Gold Mask flexes both her arms. You know, big old strongman position. Looks very proud of herself and starts just kind of strutting. All right, now it is Silver's turn. Silver is out cold. Silver oh, hit the God. ground hard. <laughs> well... Well, it's Silver's turn. <laughs> well, Silver manages Silver to pull sleep. himself up. Aww. But they are very groggy. <laughs> and uh, not, not really able to capitalize on their position. They're just standing now. All right. Copper with a mighty yell. <sighs> uh, we're gonna beat you losers within an inch of your lives, and that's the bottom line. <sighs> and makes a running dive for the only one standing, Jasmine. Quit! <laughs> Stop diving at me, it never works. <laughs> well, it is a 13. Yeah, it's actually quite good. Mm -hmm. I'm going to attempt it. Dodge. All right, so you gotta roll a total of fifteen or higher because the plus two to strike. I can do that. I can do that. I did not do that. Oh. All right. The damage to your SDC is as follows. As follows. Wait a sec. Is this segmented? Do I need to whip out my big calculator? 17. Yeah, that's, that's not great. I've still got a lot. Fortunately, you have the natural carapace, at least. I do have the natural carapace. I'm at 73. All right. He takes, uh, he attempts to knee you in the face. With, uh, but it, it fails. Okay. Just clunks off of you. Spins around for a backhanded strike. Rude. And that's 16. Can you're going to try and dodge or parry that one? 
you need shooting. You need shooting I do, moves. I do need shooting moves. But you can if you want to. I'm just. I'm just saying. I'm gonna gold mask one already. Silver mask one already. This is copper's last maneuver. I guess I don't know how many of those there are. Mm -hmm. Um, I'm going to try to dodge this. All right. Need a 16 or better. Oh, 16 or better. Yeah. I mean, I might as well. Not, oh yeah, that does it. There we go. All right. There we go. It was a spinning attack, so he's now off balance, and now it's the next person's turn. Uh, that's that... Pam, right? Is it Pam or Jazz? Um, it's, it's not, not me. me. I'm dead last. Okay, it's Pam then. I mean, I also am dead last. I rolled a, I rolled a two. Pam is, 11, so. Pam is prone. You're gonna have to use. If you're gonna try and stand up, you're gonna have to. You're gonna can have to use steps? an action for that. Can I throw stuff like laying down? Is there stuff near me? I mean, you can fire your gun, maybe. Okay, so let's see what I'm gonna do here. Uh, you could theoretically just take four pot shots from your position. Yeah, I think that would work pretty well. Mm-hmm. I might. Did I use? Did I use it? No, I didn't. Uh, okay. Whoops. The parrot goes flying into the room. Um, that's 14. Do you have a bonus to your shooting? Uh, where would I find this? Let me see. Well, if you're just doing a regular shot, then I guess you don't get a... I guess it would be an aimed shot since you have... Uh, since you technically have time to aim from where you are. You're not shooting wild since you haven't moved. Um, let me bring up the battle rules real quick. Uh, rifts, rifts, rifts. There it is. Rifts, 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 rifts. All right, you get plus three to strike at with your, uh, okay, so, yeah, you, you rolled 14, so that's a 17. Did you roll, did you roll, you haven't rolled, oh, you did roll. It's okay. still there. 17, so that's a definite hit. And remember, uh, because of your psychic state this last round, you can actually do called shots for specific body parts and hit pretty easily. Okay, um, I'm going to shoot a uh, shoot legs. All yeah. right. Well, since I forgot to remind you of that, you can just do that. All right, whose legs, by the way? Oh, uh, uh, golden, golden mask. All right. Gold mask takes eight, nine, 11. ten, eleven damage. At which she's she's none too happy about that, and she starts or and she uh, stumbles as her legs get shot. She is no longer taunting, and she's uh, faced off towards you now. You gonna keep shooting? Uh, let's see. All right, so I do I have time to get up and do stuff, right? You can use a move to stand back up, yeah. Okay, I'm I'm standing up now. Okay. Can I? How close? How close are we? I would say that you can approach and attack with one action at that distance. Okay, I'm gonna do an approach and attack. Okay. <laughs> uh, just like a barehanded strike, or with your gun, or. Uh. I was thinking, like, I don't know, punch. I'm gonna do a punch. Okay. <laughs> do, one, do one of those. Take a good old swing at her. Gotta roll a five or better. 17. Oh. That does it. <laughs> roll from a two to a 17. <laughs> All right. And you get plus. You get plus 11 damage, was it? Uh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 And what do I roll? What do I roll for that damage? Uh, the barehanded attack standard is two d four, right? Or is it one d four? I think it's one d four for a barehanded attack. Just one. Yeah. Uh, one d four for a restrained. Two d four for a full. No, that's that's training. So I don't know. Yeah, I think it's just one d four. Okay. That's, that's a six. A six. <laughs> this 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 one. The pointy one. No. The other There's pointy, one. The this one. one. This one they I'm are, holding. Um, yes, that's my bad. They are very the pointy. Pyramid. They're all pointy. They're all the pointy one. 
can't all be the sassy one. Oh, that's a four. Ooh, That'll do it. Do. So that is four, 15 damage. All right. Um, and I guess you have one more action. Uh, can I... Can I do a, a good, a very strong, a very good strong kick? Yeah, you can give it a shot. You get plus four kick shot. Oh, it was almost a twenty, so that's a twelve. That'll that's that's a good strong kick, and I think kicks are one d six. That's the that's the this one. Yeah. So that's one. That's fine. That's still uh, twelve damage. Fuck. And with that kick, she goes stumbling back, falling over Copper Mask, knocking Copper Mask over as well, into Jasmine. Oh no. But I'm fine. So you're starting out with Copper just... No, no Silver's fine. Chopping it up, yeah. <laughs> uh, copper is just, like, on you. Uh, uh, unless you want to roll to dodge or something. It might, it might be my turn, but... This is fine. I can have this happen. Uh, what did you roll for your initiative? Three. You would altogether. Be, you would be ahead of me. Okay, so it's Rai's turn. Yeah, you're just dealing with that for all of my all of my moves for for now. Or you could get, punch get them and get them off me. Rai is... I don't know. I'm, I'm on the floor, Jasmine. I am literally laid out on the floor. Contemplating this is actually choices. going like a wrestling match, too. <laughs> People just falling all over each other. This is wonderful. It's, it's a, not a wrestling from, match. It's a comedy of errors. Uh -huh. that, that's mostly what it is, yes. <laughs> Sitting in this pot with a wrestling match. Mm -hmm. I guess, um, from my position on the floor, just splayed out on the floor, looking at whatever is on the ceiling at this present moment, I'm just going to reach into my bag mm. pocket and whatever whatever holes that i might dang it no we're not doing this <laughs> um <laughs> listen but whatever whatever um things that hold things mm -hmm. i have in my possession generally yeah i'm going to reach into one of those and i'm going to pull out a health potion and then i'm going to roll my 2d20 all right to see how this is going to go I know Reach. where 1d20 is. Reaching into oh, the non-bodily holes. All right, you hear the strange. Oh, no. You hear a strange sound in the distance. It sounds like this. That's a bad sound. <laughs> that doesn't really happen, but I just had to say it. I was thinking it too. Is the worst part about it. I was just like, <sighs> okay, all right, let's do this thing. All right, roll them 2d20s. And you heal 19, 19 damage. 19 damage, which is okay, but it could have been better given that they were d20s. Mm. It's fine. <laughs> Let's do this. All right. Okay, so I used one move, at least one move to dodge. Mm. Two, one or two, I think two moves to dodge. Yeah. And then one to do... Was that an action? One to drink, yeah. One to drink. Drinking is an action. So that's... I have two moves. I could spend one of them getting up. Or who's next to me right now? Jasmine and Copper. I'm going to wrap my tail around Copper's legs. All right. Trip him. I'm, I'm, not, I'm not getting up from here. This has been a disaster. All right. Roll to trip. Just just, just the one. No, 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 no. <laughs> Hold on. Okay. I did. Oh, never mind. Let's just re-roll that. Um. That's a seven. Well, that's a seven. Plus, okay, that does it. Well, well, you on the floor. Well, now I feel better because at least somebody else is on the floor with me. Yeah, um, Copper is now off of Jasmine and on the floor. So can wow. I stab him? Can I stab him from the carpet? Is Absolutely, that, is you can. That is cool, a cool. very reasonable move. Just get over here, and then just stab. It's fine. Get over here. <laughs> Not again. No, it's gone. So, so, it's no, gone no, it's, no, it's no, fine. No, no, no. All right. Yay, That's a hit. Okay, let me find all of those tiny, the tiny pointy ones. There we are.
And that's four. That's another four. Yeah. Yeah. Um. We're not doing an, a lot of damage. We're just kind of knocking each other over mm -hmm. like bowling pins. <laughs> I don't. I don't. I don't know how this is working. <laughs> I don't know how this is going to work. We're going to when we do the leveling up. We're going to upgrade some of the weapons as well from Charlie. Because at this point, it feels like everyone is just a tank. All right. Uh, do you are you're you're doing a double attack, right? Was oh wait, yes, I forgot how my 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 stab things work. Yeah. I forgot how stabbing worked for just one hot second there. Mm -hmm. Let me go find my D twenty. I made it big, and now I've lost. No, this is his one. Okay. The other one's all the way at the corner here. Well, that's a 10. So that's, All right, that's, that's a it. Okay, uh, let's try this again. And that's two damage. And that's a two. <laughs> All right. And now it's Jasmine's turn. Yeah, I wasn't pushing your calculator off the edge. <laughs> Rude. I'm pretty sure oh, that's my turn. Um, uh-oh, uh-oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Um. Yeah. So here's what my cursor is doing now. This. Well, stop I that. I can't make it not do that. What's it doing? It's Have you... doing this now. It's just moving stuff. Um, that's not. That's not ideal. Try it's, clicking with each button. It's. It's not. If I change it to grab, is that better? That's better. All right. What was it? I don't fucking know. I was on draw, but it shouldn't have been doing that. No, it shouldn't have. I have a dice in my hand. I don't know what I'm doing. Uh, <laughs> listen, I have two. Listen, I have two listen, moves. I do, it's, it's, yeah, you it have, you have two is. moves left. You have a shotgun. I, no, I don't. I have my pistol. I've used up my shotgun. I oh, could reload right. it. Yeah, but... you could reload it and then fire. Yeah, uh, but I think instead of that, I'm just going to shoot this mouse. Point blank. Point blank with this pistol. All right. It's it's technically hit. It's fine. Yeah, that'll do it. Oh, and they can't uh, dodge or anything. Mm hmm. That's 2d4, I'm pretty sure. Yep. Uh, 2d4 or 2d6, something like that. It's 2d4 because it's the pistol. Okay. The shotgun's d6s. Okay. Nope. Get over there so I can grab you both at the same time. There we are. Four and six. six. All right. Let's see how much damage that is. All right. Um, this time, this time, the wound looks exceptionally bad. Good. And he is very, very bloodied. So... I mean, there's... There's not, there's not a great reason to do, not do it again. Uh-huh. So... Proper, the shortest lived. Yeah, that's 12. And... 7 altogether. All right. Uh, Copper is now... Um, I suppose I should roll for injury, because that's more than half of his remaining HP. Um, we'll just say he's severely injured, and you can't necessarily tell what's wrong. All right. But he is not getting back up at this point. I imagine the, the bullet holes would give some clue. <laughs> We'll figure out uh, any specific injuries. I'll figure that out on my own time later. Um, so you've still got two opponents left, and uh, I guess it's the next round. Oh, right. Gotta, gotta roll fast. I feel sorry for uh, Silver Mask, because they, uh, 
They've only Oops. been injured once, and it was just by falling flat on their face. I got right. seven. Rai goes that was first. Not, that's a not twenty. <laughs> yeah. Plus plus one, so a twenty-one if that matters. Um. Oh wow, and they they rolled a one, which makes sense because they just saw a copper get get knocked the fuck out. So I also rolled a twenty, so your plus one does matter because it means you go first. Yeah. Rai, then Jazz, then Pam, then the masks. All right. Uh, silver is up. And gold is prone. And Rai is prone as well. <laughs> and... As is copper. Copper is extra prone. Okay, so he doesn't look like a threat anymore, right? Not even remotely. Okay, well, uh, then I'm going to tackle the, the wolf. No, I'm going to tackle the fox. Okay. I'm going to tackle the fox that is not a friend. Wait, no, I'm not a wrestle pause. This is so frustrating. <laughs> <laughs> it's just, I, I just, I just want to just attack. I want to go for the face, but that's not a, a reasonable strategy here. Um, okay. I don't want to leap because I know I, my uh, initiative notwithstanding, I don't think my dice are going to let me do what I want to do. Ah. Uh. Um, so I'm not going to spend this round poisoning. We don't have time for that. Uh, okay, so wait, so, so, so wolf friend is next to 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 fox friend mm -hmm. and who is looking the most injured definitely gold silver like i said silver has only been oh, yeah. injured so by so falling so on their face silver boot their own snoot so yep. okay i'm gonna go with gold <laughs> oh boy um, well oh wait mm. I'm going to run this by. Uh, I do still have a lasso on me. Okay. Would, would, throwing, would throwing this, would lassoing, would tying up this fox do anything for me? I mean, maybe? Not, not, not in a, not, not in, not in a sexual kind of situation. I mean, I mean that's, that's, that's your thing right there, but, um, I mean, I just, I mean, like in general, like in a, in a battlefield kind of situation. I mean, sure. If you could uh, get it on him and he's still looking a little dazed cause he just got up. Um, uh, okay. This, I'm, I'm racked with uncertainty. Okay, mm -hmm. so, mm, well, I'm I'm over here, and I don't want to. I can I can drag them over here if I if if I get the rope around them. Mm -hmm. What would I be rolling for? I guess it'd just be like, do you have like a skill to throw it? I have a skill to get out of rope, and I have a skill to um for delicate skill checks. I have advanced touch. I don't know if this is a delicate skill. <laughs> no, not like that. <laughs> ah, listen. Um, um, I, and I am, I am technically a doctor in the most technical of senses. Mm -hmm. So I don't know if that helps anything at all. I mean, you could make the argument for it being part of hunting, therefore being part of... But there's not really a... You know what? Since you have hunting, we're going to go with Well, just... wait. I, I don't have hunting. Pan has hunting. I have wilderness survival. I'm looking at your character sheet, and you also have tracking, hunting. I have I have tracking, but not hunting. Hunting Where? is listed under it. But that's I'm not blind. a... That's not Hold a numbered on. skill. Which I mean is just... Oh, wait. No, I have tracking. I just have tracking. Mm-hmm. I have escape artist and then tracking. I have sign language writing, escape artist, and tracking. Mm. On the secondary skills list, I don't have hunting. All I don't. Right. I, I don't hunt. What am I looking only, at here? Only people. I hunt. Oh, sorry. I was looking at the wrong damn sheet. Um. Current rye. There we go. All right. Camouflage, radio, acrobatics. 
swimming. I could a fly through the air with the greatest of ease and just end up with a rope over over friend. You know what? We can we can make it. We can say you can do it because of acrobatics. That's that's totally fine with me. All right. So I'll take an action to just kind of be weird about this rope thing. Okay. All right. And make an attack roll. All right. Fast and loose with the rules here. All right, Quickly. that does it. Uh, okay, Silver so... makes no attempt to dodge. I, that worries me. Um, let's tighten the rope and bring them over here, I guess. All right. Um, is it, does, does, does anyone... Wait, no, I'm the only person who can make attacks right now. Yeah. This would be a good opportunity for, like, side whatevers. All right, um, so their arms are... Enclosed. This was basically an entangle roll, I guess. Yes. Um, okay, so I have... No, I have three more moves because I got up from prone. Yeah. yeah. So... It wouldn't make sense to shoot them... Shoot them here. Oh, you also drank your potion, right? Oh, yeah, okay. So you so have two more moves. One, two... Okay, yeah, okay. So I have two... Hmm... Huh. Can, uh, can I tighten my rope work here? I mean, it presumably tightened about as much as it's going to when you yanked him over. Okay, well, well, that's done. So I guess I can stab in the, all the places that the rope isn't. All right. So you can do two double attacks, I guess? Uh, yeah, let's go with that. Because at this point, I don't, I don't know if it makes sense. No, I should probably save for dodging, huh? And parrying, huh? Uh, it's I up to have, you. I don't have that much <laughs> STC left. <laughs> oh no. Um, that'll be fine. That'll be fine. I'm gonna I'm gonna attack once, and then I'm gonna chill with my last move for whatever. Okay. One. Oh my god. Well, I don't do any of that because now I'm on the floor. I guess. Do well, I you don't necessarily. Fall over, fall over, you but know, you do stumble over this way. I had, I had planned on using the fact that you had tied up their only remaining upright friend as a bargaining chip to get gold to stop fighting. <laughs> Listen, we're not. This isn't. We're, we're, this is clown school for clowns. It we're is not. clown school for clowns. <laughs> to not try to bring seriousness in this situation because it's clown school for clowns. That's <laughs> fair. You're, you know what? You're right. This is clown school for fucking clowns. So, like, I, I, I'm just gonna keep my move and, and we'll move on. We're just gonna pretend that didn't happen. Alright. Oh, um, God. What's next? Jasmine's next? Yeah. Um, I'm going to use a an action mm -hmm. to reload my shotgun. Mm -hmm. Then I'm going to use an action to fire my shotgun into gold mask. All right. If I can figure out what in God's name I did with my thing. Here we go. I'm sad I missed that. Uh, yep, that didn't oh. do it. That didn't do it. Firing wow. the second one of my two that I have. That's a hit. It's an hit. They're not going to try and dodge or anything? Nope, she's nope. prone. All right. Nope. Six damage? Yep. All right. And there we go. Um, now it's Pam's turn. Yeah, I still have one move yeah. left, but I am. Oh, I okay. Okay. Well, I said that's that's that, so I assume. I did. I did. You were okay. correct. I just wanted to. I just wanted to clarify. Okay, I you can... do have one action left. Yeah. All right. All right. I'm pretty close. Am I close enough to do a, a physical attack? Yes, you are absolutely close enough to Silver to do a physical attack. Okay. Can I do a tackle? Sure. That'd be like a wrestling type move. 
and just spear him to the ground. You know, that's a finisher for some characters. We're going to pin. <laughs> All right, you're going to... Okay, so that's your attack to knock him down. Yep, pin time. All right. Uh, 17... Is yeah, that's that's definitely knocks him down. You're gonna want to roll, I guess, since this is gonna be a full force style attack. I guess it's still just gonna be one d six plus your eleven. This one, I think, no the pip right? one with the pips. That's <laughs> yeah. All right, oh that God. is seventeen <laughs> damage. <laughs> finally, finally, someone injures Silver Mask. I did it. And a silver mask very tackled now. Is that? Uh, yeah. Now you're on top of them, and you can. Are you standing or are you laying on top of them? Uh, I, I was thinking laying. Okay. So now you're laying on top of them. You've still got three more actions. I gotta gotta roll to knock out. Okay. We're going for that by. knockout blow to the face, huh? Uh, yeah, yep. And we're saying that'll work because they are still dazed, tied up, and under a giant reet. Whoops. <laughs> and eight plus the four, that is definitely enough to put them out cold for the round. Nice. And uh, any more actions you want to take? I saw that. I saw that. Uh, oh, also roll for damage on that strike, which is 1d4 plus 11. Okay, d4, yeah? Yeah. I saw that piece go through the table, then come back up. <laughs> Achievement unlocked. This is Dark Souls. Uh, 15 damage. Wow. All right. And I guess that means it's Gold Mask's turn. Unless you want to do anything else. Is th I'm not sure there's anything else to do here. All right. Is that everybody? I mean, it's everybody. All right, yeah, Gold Mask slowly slowly sits up, looking at the carnage before her. She uh, reaches for the device at her belt, holds it up, and presses another, and presses one of the buttons on it. Wait, the uh, There is a flash and a ringing. Um, anyone who wants to react who has actions left may but it's going to be like a flashbang effect. So I'm going but, to say roll to dodge on this one. I right. am going to roll to dodge. 13 is not a bad dodge. Is 1 a good dodge? Not at I, all. I think 20 is a good dodge. 20 is a so, very uh... good dodge unless she rolls a natural... Well, she doesn't even need... It. It's, unless she rolls a natural 20, rise fine and won't be blinded. Uh, that's a three that's, plus four, so. Bad. All right. I'm not blinded either. No, Pam's the only one who gets blinded by it. Uh, there's still a ringing in everyone's ears. That is inconvenient for me. Gold Mask's voice is shockingly audible, even for those with the ringing in their ears. And she says, you may have won this day, but the other wretched creatures are going to burn in that plant. She uh, quickly goes around and with almost supernatural speed and strength scoops up her companion and dashes for the scoops up both her companions and dashes for the door. Only one. I am out of moves. All right. I am. I. I'm Rise tired. Rise out of moves and Pam is blinded, so she's she gets away. Yeah, like it's just. It's just... Lonnie we... is starting to stand up, arm over her eyes, and says, What did she just say? Uh, uh, 
I'm pretty sure she said they were gonna burn the lab, so maybe we should get to the lab. Uh, you don't hear me? I can't uh, hear me. Uh, 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 rise, yes. rise, good hearing. Uh, Pam. I, I, I don't think I can hear stuff. Lonnie. I got you. Lonnie got you. seems to be okay. Lonnie seems to be okay with her ears as she pushes herself up. And she waves her arms and just starts pointing frantically north for those who can't hear. All right, all right, I got it, I got it, I got it. Just, oh. <laughs> maybe, maybe like a, like a five minute uh, uh, first aid sesh, please? They're gonna burn the not, it's, we it's can't not even for my sake. Thing. Oh, okay, fine, jeez. <laughs> a trail of carnage greets you. Soldiers lying on the pavement. Old cars, doors caved in. And you do indeed see smoke rising. And yet, miraculously, sometimes things can go right. Sitting by the hole in the fence is Edie, waving tiger tiredly. And uh, lingering outside are the lab's inhabitants. Fearful, cautious, but alive and mostly unhurt. The lab itself is smoking and will likely not be inhabitable again. Izzel waves his massive claw as he sees you approach. Edie slowly pushes herself up onto her feet and jogs toward you, scooping up Rye in a tight hug. Dang, Rye, I thought for sure you was going to bite it. Her eyes brim really? with tears. Me? Me? <laughs> Lonnie limps <Yeah>. about. <laughs> Lonnie limps about, eyeing the many creatures who live here. When she finally faces up to Izzel, she gasps slightly, a look of realization crossing her face. She's taken aback further upon seeing the tiny human girl attached to his leg. But he speaks first, preventing any awkwardness. Your companions. He motions sweepingly to the four of you, including Edie. Saved all of our lives. The tide of military force has ended. I am... He moves his larger arm to show many dings and cracks in his scales. Only bulletproof for so long. Edie is excitedly babbling about all the cool psionic powers she got to see, just like in the books. Mirabelle, meanwhile, stays close to Pam, looking dazed, unsure, and even ashamed of herself, mirroring the tiny human clinging to Izzel's calf. Alright, so what's the plan from here on? Um, hmm. More running, sounds like, huh? <laughs> more friends. To... More friends, yeah. Yeah, more friends. Um, uh, all right. So, well, taking them back uh, to camp? I mean, you... yeah. Because, wait, yeah, wait, sure. no. can, can we clarify the situation with the dead horse? The horse um, is dead. The yes, horse yes, is definitely you. dead. Uh, what about the people that the dead horse uh, was protecting initially? We don't know much about them. Um, I mean, you can... Could try to contact them. At this point, they're all basically hidden, and you don't see any of them nearby, certainly. Well, uh, okay, so I just wanted to make sure, because he did sell them out, correct? He sold out the people in yeah. the lab in exchange for his people. Ah, okay, well, his people are... Although, apparently, fine. that wasn't a thing either, because... Yeah, that's... ...that they the shot the horse man. man. Uh-huh. Yeah, so I'm a bit worried about them. Okay. Even though, even though the people who... Even though the horse was bad, that doesn't mean that all the not-horses are bad. I agree, and I think maybe it's useful to talk to them. Okay. So but, that'll be something we flesh out over the next little while. So, But, uh, but in the meantime, in the actual present time for, for these people, we should probably take them back to camp. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I mean, they don't I, have another place. And yeah, they don't. Christy said, run. What direction would you plan on running in? Like, my suggestions for possible targets are heading all the way to Georgia to, fit, to get back up from Lonnie's people. You could head back towards the city, though that might be kind of foolhardy. I don't know that you're strong enough to mount an assault just yet. Or further into woods, or just anywhere, really. Hmm. Like, where do y'all have family that could help? Stuff like that. 
Colorado is pretty far, and also I didn't leave under the best of circumstances. Mm -hmm. So, uh. Texas uh, is closer, but we'd have to double back, like, nearer to the city. Mm hmm. Georgia's further away, but is certainly away. Mm hmm. Ah. Uh, I don't. I wouldn't mind Georgia. It's been on my mind. It has, uh, for various reasons. Uh, I guess, I guess we'll head to Georgia. All oh, right. We can talk. We can talk about this on the way. On the way back to camp. Yeah. The midnight train. All right. On the midnight train. Let's do an outro here then. Now that we've got our uh, future plans set up, <clears throat> and we're gonna level up after the outro. So cool, stick cool, around cool. for that. <clears throat> Sometimes, things go right. Most of the time, as the burning lab and the corpse-littered town would attest, they do not. But for now, at least, things were quiet. The masks had escaped more or less intact, and with them, whatever knowledge Alan had given them in a naive attempt to protect his town. Questions still remained. What did the masks now know? What had happened with Pam and her deadly calm? Why had Lonnie's psionics failed her so spectacularly? Where were the remaining inhabitants of New Still Waters? Why were there so many soldiers just dead in the streets? And what terrible adventures await our heroes in this impossible land? Perhaps the answers lie to the east, with Lonnie's shogun, or perhaps back west in Oklahoma City itself. But for now, they return to camp, because with the rats knowing their location, there's no time to waste. All right. Whew. So, finish that up just in time. That actually worked out really well. A lot. Uh-huh. Yeah, boss fights. I'm going to I'm going to start increasing the damage everyone does. First of all, Charlie is going to upgrade everyone's weapons because obviously wow. that's needed now. So, uh with Charlie and <laughs> with Charlie and the Angels, um, I'm going to say um, for for each of your basic melee weapons, I'm going to say add uh, plus plus two damage to each of them. Am I getting iron gloves or? Oh, for that's your... my melee weapons. Oh, you... if it's a natural claw, we'll worry about that as you level. Well, like, what do I what do I add to it? Uh. Of uh, like rye rye stuff is one d four two d four two d four plus plus two two d four plus two damage yeah. will be what rye does. Um, okay, Pam, so my, does Pam have a melee weapon? I have an axe and a battle axe. Ah, right. Can she right. specialize in door? <laughs> yeah, I was gonna ask. Does my door maybe plus... maybe later? Okay, on top of that, Pam now has basic combat. Wow. So you can you can toss that up there. Everyone is now level two. Ooh, oh, so we should roll, we should roll we should roll hit dice. Does. Okay. We should roll hit dice for that. Yes. Um one, I one D six hit dice per level. Ooh. Yeah, one D six hit dice. Which increases your, your HP, not your SDC. That makes right. you harder to kill, albeit not a whole lot. Not a whole lot, no. Where where have I thrown these? I got three. What do I do with the three? Uh, you add... add you know what? I say just... Yeah, this is... Okay, add three to your max HP. Not SDC, HP. Oh, three as well. So. Okay. So th max HP. Okay, so, all right. I'm oh, sorry, what the hell am I rolling? Uh, 1d6. Oh, 1d6. Plus three. No, just 1d6. Oh. Uh, is my SDC four. reset? All right, so... Jasmine adds four. Do what? Uh, my uh, SDC is that reset now? Yeah, your SDC is back at its maximum. Well, once we get somewhere where I can work some magic, but yeah, check in, in a game sense, yes. Yes. Oh yeah, my uh, weapons. Um, I what think I... Jasmine also gets plus two from her physical endurance. She gets an additional plus two HP. I think that's how that works. Uh. Got me, friend. I'm, uh... I'm... All of 
You're... I, don't know, I don't know how literally okay, no. any of this works. No, there's no, there's no additional from physical endurance. All um, right. So all, the, all the primary skills get a plus yeah. five, I think? All your, all your skills get whatever the, the growth number the, the, is. Yeah, the growth, the growth thingy is. Oh, cool, cool, cool. So, let's say, let's look at Pam's, for instance. Uh, her gardening would should now farming and gardening should now read forty four plus four, wilderness survival should read thirty five plus five and so on. I got two more feet. Mm. Uh, you don't get additional combat skill bonuses till level three, so we won't worry about that. Oh, let me let me. Uh, what are my melee weapons? Are those anything? Uh, your axe and your. Battle axe each get have now have an additional plus two damage to them. Okay, my axe and my axe. Yes. Uh I I found a page and I found a fairly important page. Okay. Uh my acrobatics do in fact have some um sub whatevers. Okay, you can add those on, in. On forty nine, I mean. Okay. Like I have I have like like sense of balance and walk tightrope and climbing and backflip. Okay, I'm gonna have I'm gonna have you keep track of those, okay? Okay, all right. All right, and on top of that, uh, each Rye is learning. What was the skill Rye was learning? To to drive, although I'm not sure how relevant that's going to be now. Okay, and Jasmine, what was Jasmine learning? Uh, wrestling from Pam. All right, perfect. So you can both add those in. Um, drive will have its very basic. You don't you don't get the additional plus to it because it's a brand new skill. Okay. All right. So your driving will be where is that written? I'm looking at Rise character sheet instead of Jasmine's. Yeah, look at the one who hadn't learned it yet. Uh, yeah, your your car pilot will be seventy plus four. Okay, there we go. All right. Um... All right. Each of your uh, let's see. Each of your uh, guns now is going to get the Charlie special, which is whatever kind of dice you roll for their damage, they get an additional one of those. Sounds Where is that? Pretty at? tech. Meaning that, like. Uh, the revolver will now do 3d4 damage. So is my, my guns are now... Yeah, your rifle is now going to do... I'm going to say it's specifically the ones you're skilled in. Okay, so, so just the rifles. Both yeah, just the, your bolt-action rifle is now going to do 5d6 damage. That is a nasty weapon. All right, so Pam now will also have uh, four actions instead of three, and they can all be used for... Is there a place to mark that down, the actions? Yeah, it's under attacks in the combat section. Uh, what was the number? Uh, you now have four attacks. And I guess under special, put plus, or no, under damage, you would put plus 11 because of your extra physical strength. Oh, okay. Pam is now a combat force to be reckoned with. Everyone should uh, be able to do a bit more damage at a time and speed up combat a bit. And I think that's everything. And next session, we're heading for Georgia. Nice. Oh, heck. Wait. Um, plus, uh, uh, at level two, I get plus two to parry and dodge. I'm, everybody has hand to hand basic, right? Oh, I thought it, you didn't get a bonus to level three. It's mm, on one foot. Oh, no, you're right. Plus two to parry and dodge. Everyone gets that. Wait, so that's plus two in addition to what I already had? Yes. Oh, oh heck, okay. 
So everyone mark down that extra plus two to parry and dodge. Oh hey, I finally have a bonus to those. Hell yeah. Oh, plus I guess whatever wrestle gives me. Wrestle probably gives me something. Oh yeah, wrestling also gives bonuses, so you can figure that out. And just once <laughs> everyone's got their uh, sheets finished, get them to me over Discord, and we'll we'll figure it out, or we'll get stuff going uh, next time. We had a whole plus two to roll with Punch Fall at Impact, and we never used it. Well, oh, now well. you know. Oh, well, it's fine. <laughs> uh... <laughs> Well, thanks everyone for joining. We'll be uh, we'll be back tomorrow. Alice will be with uh, her her Lego her bootleg Lego trash beetle build. Friday is uh, me with. Mm, I think I'm gonna start the longest journey. I might play a little Ko the Kangaroo first though, because that's pretty fun. Let's see. You're not gonna do a 100% completion. I, I doubt that. Maybe I'll play it for, like, one level each week. That might be a fun way to do it. Uh, Saturday morning is Christy's wild card stream. I'm going to be playing Magic because of the uh, new uh, Magic the Gathering 20, 2020. Yeah. Magic the Kittening. Magic the Kittening. Uh, people are already setting off fireworks. They're a day early. Like, they're oh. setting them off as though it's tomorrow. Oh, I'm so I think, sorry. Um, so I was hearing uh taps on my window and i was wondering where the where the taps came from because i would open the blinds and there'd be no one there uh, -huh. uh and i think they're fireworks actually very probably all right sunday is going to be zoo with mother three monday is going to be christy with hypnospace outlaw tuesday is going to be annie with iconoclasts and wednesday is our next community day have not decided what game to play then yet so uh just just keep on coming back and we'll keep streaming games watch that space uh thanks for everyone who came to watch and we'll see you next time i've been here with xenon mox and christy and you can follow our team below here on the page the uh at truck.community so we'll we'll see you next time good night everyone uh, good night